Hi, I'm going to uh, teach you how to make kimchi today. Uh, this is what I learned from the internet. It is very simple. All you need to do is have some basic ingredients like this. And I'm going to show you what they are and the steps involved. Now I bought one and a half kilos of uh, Chinese cabbage. I season it in uh, 200 grams of salt in salt water for about 5 hours and it has shrunk to this size. Now this is ready, I washed it already. So I have prepared the ingredients. The ingredients are this. Dry chili powder, spring onion, ginger shreds, garlic, chopped fish sauce, vinegar, and a little bit of sugar. You need a nice bowl like this, huge and nice. Try not to use plastic or metal. The best is to use porcelain or bowls like this. Now, I'm going to start mixing. So, now all I need to do is to put the ingredients into this uh, seasoned uh, cabbage. So, as I want it pretty hot, so I put about four tablespoons of dry chili powder. Sprinkle them on four, then uh, one half a tablespoon of sugar. This is estimate. I like it a bit sour, so I put about three tablespoons of vinegar. I'll test. I'll test it later on and see whether if I could add more. And this is the fish sauce. I'll put about three tablespoons. And I put five cloves of garlic already chopped, put it inside, all mixed. Then all the ginger shreds that I have made, it's about uh, half a palm full actually. Uh, I add in the last thing, the spring onions. Okay, not too much, I, I want to uh, keep the greens away. Okay, I'm ready to mix them. You can use it to use a hand to mix or the spoon. So I have to mix it now. I go and wash my hands now and use my hands to mix it. Now you see how uh, the colors of the chili really uh, brightens up the, the cabbage. You have to mix it thoroughly. Now it's quite dry now, it doesn't matter because as the salt and the vinegar acts on the vegetable, the, it will become a little liquid and the juice that flows out as a result it is actually quite tasty. You can use them as a kind of uh, spiced, uh, spicy stock for your meat dishes also. So don't throw any uh, liquid away after you have seasoned this. Uh, I'll taste it now and see whether it is uh, to my liking. Not hot enough. So I'm going to put a bit more chili powder. Probably I'll put two tablespoons in one. And it's not sour enough, also. Just going to add a little bit more. Put one and a half more. So I mix it again. You can actually see the vegetable being shrunken now as the ingredients work on the vegetables.
as I as I mix it, I also rub in the the uh, spicy ch uh, chili powder. Now I have to keep on doing this for a little while. Now and say an hour later, I'll toss them again to make sure that I have a powder mix of spice and vegetables. See, one and a half kilo isn't much after it has really shrink. So I'm ready to put it into the porcelain bowl and let it rest for about three days to make it really nice tasting. There you are, you see? So I pack them in. Now you can see a bit of juice at the bottom now. This is what I meant. Now, there will be more uh, production of juices from the natural fermentation that takes place. So that is nice to keep. So there you are. My kimchi. You won't be ready to eat until the best is after three days. Thank you. Hope you enjoy the kimchi.